This is Matt and this is a video on converting MP4 to MP3. So when you're converting MP4 to MP3, you're essentially taking a video file and you're extracting the audio out of that video file. So I should say at the start that you should only be doing this with videos that you actually own. So for instance, if you have a video, uh, a YouTube video and you need to extract the audio for whatever reason, and it is one of your own videos, then this is okay to do. So in order to do this, so what I mean by this is that you should only do this process on videos that you actually own and are yours. So if that is the case, I recommend using this right here. It's called shuttercoder.com. It's a really reputable piece of software. It's absolutely free. Uh, you can come to the main downloads page here and you can actually donate to the creator of this software, which I recommend that you do. But you can also choose just to have a free version and not pay at all if that's what you want to do. So they've got it for Windows and they've got it for Mac OS. If you have the latest version of Mac OS, like I do, uh, a, new, a newer uh, machine, you should go for this Apple Silicon. If not, go for the Intel 64-bit. Windows, the same over here, you have a couple of different options. So once you've actually downloaded and in downloaded and installed the software, I will show you what it looks like. So Shutter Encoder looks like this. So this is the main Shutter Encoder page. So what we're gonna to have to do right now is come up here to the very top left and we're going to click on Browse. So we need to first load a video in here. I have one pre-prepared. It's one of my own uh, YouTube videos right here, one I haven't published yet. So we have this MP4, which is the purpose of this video. We're doing MP4 to MP3, and we're going to click on open. So that will open the MP4 there. And you see that there's a range of different options and it might be a little bit intimidating if you're not used to audio editing or video editing or anything of that sort. If you just want to actually extract the audio in the simplest way, I'm just gonna show you a very simple setup. Uh, most of it is done for us. So down here in the bottom left, we've got MP3 set here, and now we've got a drop down here. So if we click the drop down, now for most cases, 320 will be really good, really good audio. So if you're extracting um, maybe some uh, music or some singing uh, of that sort, you might go 320. Uh, but for a lot of people, 192 is absolutely perfect for tutorial videos. So I'm just going to go for 380 because why not? Uh, 320 even because why not? Uh, up here, we've got some uh, refining that we can do. You can choose to uh, fine tune things if you so desire, but that is not required. If you just want a very simple setup, we're going to extract to MP3 and we are doing it from MP4. So we can now click start function. And just like that, we have our MP3 has actually been outputted. You can see in the original folder, I have this MP3 here. So that was the MP4. We've now got the MP3 has been outputted. So that was really simple. Uh, I highly recommend getting the free shutter encoder where you can do all sorts of different audio and video conversions. It's great for the one that I just showed you, which is a simple MP4 to MP3 where we're just extracting the audio. Highly recommend you get that. Uh, link is below to get it. Like I say, it's free. You're just going to go to shuttercoder.com. I've got the link below in the description so you can just click that and it makes it super simple. So hopefully you found this video on converting from mp4 to mp3 really helpful for you if it has been helpful drop the video a like it really helps us and subscribe to the channel for more videos just like this